Thank you for coming to watch this video, Probate Real Estate Sales 101. In the next four minutes, I will teach you a few things about probate as well as showing you why this niche is so important for real estate agents and investors. You'll also learn a very easy way to increase your knowledge in this area. But first, let's start by defining what is probate. Probate is the legal term for gathering the assets of a decedent to pay his or her debts and then distributing the remaining balance to his beneficiaries. But why is probate important if I'm in real estate? Here's why. Baby boomers control 67% of U.S. wealth. A baby boomer dies every 57.9 seconds, so through the course of this video, we'll probably lose four of them, unfortunately. Now, when the person dies, their assets have to transfer to somebody else. Many times, that's via a sale to a regular individual done by a real estate agent or to an investor. But what about this? Have you thought about the Zillow Trulia merger? Here you have Zillow, the site that has the sellers. You have Trulia, the site that has the buyers, and they merge. Well, why would you need a real estate agent anymore? You've got the sellers and the buyers. Heck, most of the information in real estate is now available online and various different websites, so why do we need real estate agents? Well, don't worry, I'm a real estate professional, so I'm advocating for the real estate professionals, but here's the key. As a real estate agent in the industry today, you have to establish true value that you provide to the consumers. If not, very soon, you may be out of business. The probate niche requires special skill and knowledge that you cannot get from just a regular website, that you cannot get just from looking something up online. So let's first talk about how people avoid probate. The first way is by putting a property in a trust. If they have their property in a trust, the trust doesn't have to go through the probate courts. The second way is by having a revocable transfer on death deed. Many states have these types of deeds. In fact, California is putting those in law on January 1st, 2016. But let's look at how many properties are actually in trust. What's the percentage of homes that have a trust? I've checked this in many different areas, and here's the key. It's less than 15% normally. I've seen as high as 18 or 19%, but I've also seen as low as 2%. So roughly 85% of homes would end up in probate court when the owner dies. Very important point. So what causes a probate sale or a trust sale? Well, actually, I just gave you that answer, the death of the owner. You see, it doesn't matter whether they have a trust or not. It doesn't matter if they have a revocable transfer on death deed or not on the property. The fact is, when the owner dies, the heirs many times decide that they will not be able to keep the property. Either they can't afford it, or they don't want it, or for whatever other reasons. And when that transfer has to take place, it creates an opportunity for an investor to come in or for a real estate agent to come in and list the property. So regardless of how they hold title, if you're marketing yourself as a probate specialist, if you're marketing yourself about someone who knows about these types of matters, you're going to generate and discover properties for sale. I've written a book called Probate Real Estate Sales 101. The beauty of this book is it teaches you how to deal with the probate real estate industry. Now, I come from a closing services background, 20 years in this business, and that's the key, I think, here, because many different probate training materials are out there, but they don't always teach you how to close the transaction. So in this book, you'll learn how to find the probate properties. That's the starting point. You have to know how to find them. But more importantly, how to close a probate sale or a trust sale. I can't tell you how many times rookies that I've talked to or worked with or helped were either losing a transaction or about to lose a transaction, or maybe I talked to them after they already lost the transaction because they didn't know what they were doing. So learning how to close the transaction is the key. And how to put more money in your pocket by knowing this niche market. That is what it's really all about for investors and real estate agents. Now, here's one thing that's an undeniable fact. The greatest transfer of wealth in North America is upon us. You either position yourself to take advantage of that or you don't. Put yourself in position to take advantage of this phenomenal transfer of wealth. Buy the book today, Probate Real Estate Sales 101. 